Welcome back to the channel. I am Brandon and I am like a new signing for Arsenal. Hopefully not the only signing remaining in the window. Uh, so it is towards the end of the window uh, when I'm recording this, but maybe Neto? Maybe? Let's hope so. Anyway, uh, I'm a huge Arsenal fan. I'm not a super tactician. I do match reactions, but I know a lot about the game. So if you're interested in seeing those match reactions, come back to the video. Today we're doing more merch reviews. So if you're into everything that adidas is currently slaying on, on the arsenal racks i'm here for it i literally probably buy something once a week so if you're in, interested in something and you're not sure well, how it's going to fit what it's going to look like that's what i'm here for certainly check back to the channel i'm wearing my dna sweatshirt if you haven't checked out this review it's it's on the channel today we're going to be talking about this is the travel beanie so i know it's still warm out but winter is coming any of those GOT fans out right now? The uh, the Dragon Show, huh? Anyone? Um, so the Travel Beanie, it's actually really awesome, and I want to talk about why. And then we're also covering, let me make sure I get this right, the DNA Gray Track Jacket, which actually doesn't have great reviews on the Arsenal website, which I don't really understand why. I love this ghosted look. Um, it's subtle, but still classy. So we're going to talk about that right after the bumper. All right, so just to be clear, so you know wh how, what to expect, let's baseline. So we're gonna baseline, I am 5'10", which is 152 centimeters. I am 182 pounds, which is 82.5 kilograms, which is also 13 stones. So just if you're gonna do a baseline, compare yourself to myself, I always order larges in all Arsenal apparel. So this track jacket's a large, the hats come in one size, but I always ordered my jerseys in large as well. I mo almost always get long sleeve. I actually got short sleeve in the J new Jamaican jersey, the training kit. And that was because it's Jamaican. Like I have to order short sleeve in that. So that's why I got it. I will be doing a review on that as well. Um, I'm spending oodles and oodles of money. I'm probably actually, I got a great comment on one of my videos that I'm literally single-handedly giving all of my money for the, the new transfers for this summer. And I'm here for it and I will forever be here for it because I love this team so much and I'm loving it more and more each day. So I did get the Jamaican training kit jersey. So I will be doing a review on that as soon as it comes in, it's not here yet. So today we're talking about the travel beanie and the DNA gray track jacket. So I gave you my specs so you can compare yourself. This is in a large. So let's talk about what I love about it. One, if you look on the Arsenal website, it's like, I think it's only three out of five stars. I'm not sure why. This thing is, like, this ghost, this is this is what I'm here for. I love the ghost look. I love that it's subtle. I can wear this to business meetings and things. Yes, I wear Arsenal garb to business meetings. I certainly do, and I love it because that's just kind of my style. Um, but overall, like, nothing on the back, nothing crazy. Um, you know, ghosted uh, stripes on the side, ghosted emblem. And it's a normal Adidas track jacket. And I'll show you kind of the way it fits as well. But nothing too fancy. Collar, you know, comes mid-neck. So if you're trying to, you know, trying to keep the neck covered a little bit, it'll do decent. It's not super heavy. So I wouldn't be wearing this in November, December. But you could probably get away with this in October and September, at least here in the northeast of the United States. Um, it'll keep you reasonably warm, especially if, you, if you're wearing a long sleeve underneath. It's going to be great to travel with um, because... It's an easy throw over, but still, even if you stuff it in a bag, it's kind of this like sporty material that's not going to get all crumpled up and wrinkled. It'll kind of form fit and come right back to the way you want it. So really impressed. Um, nothing crazy on the back and you'll see some, some other video, uh, some other close-ups, but the subtle, I like the ghosted stuff on this. This is why I bought it. Cause I wanted, I'm, I'm buying everything. So who am I kidding? Okay. Also, getting ready for winter. So, I'm a pretty big hat fan, as you can tell. I wear hats almost in every video. Um, and I just, I, I have a massive hat collection. I'm a huge hat person. I think it, it's an expression for me. I like, I like bringing out my style. But when it gets cold out, I do like wearing knitted hats. This knitted hat is on a different level. It is really heavy. So, this is... I'm not going to say they're the same weight. But this bugger is real heavy, and I'm really into it. Um, in the Northeast, I do my own plowing of my driveway. I have to plow my road that I live on because the mun municipalities don't come back here. So if you're not in an area where you get snow, like like last year we got three storms with 10 inch, at least 10 inches. So knitted hats are a big deal to me. 
And also, I do sometimes wear them to work. So, like, instead of wearing a regular build hat, if it's awful outside, I'm all about bringing my beanie. Okay, so a couple things. Super dope. I'm really in love with... I like this this style of just having, like, a little band that comes over. And, like, some of the jackets are doing that. Some of the jerseys are doing that. But simple gold... Okay, so... The, <laughs> The away kit sold out. We all know that. You can't find them right now. They're going with the same style. So you could marry marry this up with a long sleeve away kit and hey, you're styling. You're styling. So one size has a nice little uh, banner flap here for the arsenal. And then not too much else, but super heavy. This thing has serious weight. I think it's going to seriously protect your head. I guarantee Europa League draw just came out today. Away. We're wearing this with the black away jerseys, assuming the opposition isn't wear black at home. I don't know. I don't know the team from nor upper northern Norway, but I'm hoping we're wearing these knitted hats with our with our black jerseys because it's going to look sick. So really a fan. It's a normal flap over, so it's not, like a, it's not like a skull beanie. It's not one size, and then you're just playing with it on your head. This actually has the flip, so you have a little bit of adjustment on the, on the sides, which I'm a fan of, but uh, yeah, let's see what it looks like on. Yeah, boom, boom. So yeah, it fits good, feels good, it's heavy. You don't have a lot of fluff. So I have a reasonably sized head. I don't know the size of my head, I probably should have brought that, but like you don't have a lot of extra because I don't like when you have puff up here. Not a lot of puff up there, so I'm, I'm a big fan. It, it, it fits good, it's not a super skull, but like I said, you have. And this part, the flat part, is actually elastic in here. So it fits tight. So instead of most of the hats like kind of just sit here and they can get a little fluffy, this actually has elasticity in, in the overall flap and it like sucks back to your head. So everything stays kind of tight. So I like, I like where that sits. I'm a huge fan of this fat. So uh, let's, let's get outside and see what the, uh, the actual track jacket looks like on. All right, so I'm outside. I'm gonna bring you down a little bit. I do have a beanie. I do have my track jacket on and I do have shorts on because it's like 80 degrees out. So I'm doing this for you, for all of you viewers, because winter's coming and we have to deal with it. So let's, let's get set up here. I'm going to get so I can actually see the fit. So this is full zip up. Collar's still pretty loose, right? This is a large. Feeling pretty good. I got a little bit of slack here. It's right below. Good there. I think it looks good. All right, let's head back in. Okay, I think that's all I wanted to cover for this video. So track jacket, full zip up, love it. It's kind of the gray DNA ghosted track jacket. Let's get a little view of the, the emblem here. Just, you know. If you want to, not a big deal. Beanie is great. If you haven't gotten it, this is the, uh, you know, matches the black and gold. The travel beanie, a big fan of that as well. So if you're into either of those, I don't know. I forget what they run for. I think this is like 25, 30 bucks. I believe this was like 80-ish and that's US dollars. So pretty pricey. It's why I do these reviews because I want to make sure people have a chance to look at them before they have to buy because this only has three stars. I'm not sure why. It fits great. It actually fits better than the other DNA uh, crew neck sweatshirt I got. So I'm definitely going to be wearing this on travel and on planes. It's going to be the perfect kind of throw over uh, for the winter. So if you're into it, you've been looking at it. Hopefully this video helps. Uh, anyway, um, I think that's it. And we'll catch you on the merch. The next merch should be the Jamaican training kit. So if you're looking for that, make sure you hang around uh, the channel and keep an eye out for that. All right, we'll catch you on the next video. Thanks.